Between Cuyamaca Rancho State Park and Palomar Mountain is a large and good-looking camping spot just outside of Julian, off Pine Hills Road. The William Heisey County Park gently rests beneath a canopy of oak and pine trees. It has all the amenities of state parks nearby, and yet rangers say it often gets overlooked. Well, everybody's familiar with Cuyamaca State Parks because they're so close to the highway. And uh, we're about four miles off the main road, and we're the last ones to fill up. We're just as pretty as the state parks and the other parks in the area. Uh, we're just the last to fill up. I have 103 campsites here. And 20% of the Heise campsites are first come, first served. No reservations required. State parks don't do that. But search high and low, and you won't find many of the things abundant at Palomar Mountain State Park. Lush is what it is, and thick, and green, and different. Or take a person in a helicopter and drop them off in the middle of this park, and they would probably feel they're up in the Sierra Mountain areas. We're the only park that has this type of environment in Southern California. The forest here gets about 50 inches of rainfall a year. Now that's what separates its look from other forests in our area. This kind of dense lushness is just about what you'd find in the Sierra Nevadas, though you won't find any redwoods here. You will find ferns, bracken ferns, acres of them, and oak and pine trees, firs, and majestic incense cedars. No, not redwoods, but close enough to give you that high mountain feeling. And it's more than a feeling. Campsite elevations here run from 4,600 feet to more than a mile high. As far as wildlife, we have about everything you can find that you would find in California, with exception of porcupine, beaver, or bear. We have no bear in this mountain. There are bobcats, an occasional mountain lion, and deer. And of the three, you might catch a glimpse of a doe or a buck on the 10 to 12 miles of hiking trails here. But you will see many of the things which otherwise are just not to be found this far south in the state. It's close to the house, you know, I mean, we live like an hour away, and it's a secluded campground. It's quiet, and the trees are great, and we, we like it, all the birds and the animals. Palomar State Park has a main camping area and a group camping site and either can accommodate trailers or RVs up to 21 feet. Each campsite has available water and there are bathrooms and showers with hot and cold running water. But the main camping area has only 31 sites. That's small compared with other local state parks. Alternative sites on the mount are even smaller. Besides a group camp, the U.S. Forest Service has a regular campground with 20 sites. The county has another with just eight. We need the business. We need the campers. We need uh, the tourists. We need the vacationers. Wherever you camp, you're near the town of Palomar. It's not big, but it's got its own zip code and general store and post office and restaurant. Besides supplies and firewood, you get opinion from locals on why they think Camping Palomar is the best there is. It's just so much in the woods. You're just really out in nature when you're up here. Uh, you down the hill, you're going to be hotter and dustier, I think. Palomar Mountain is a total experience. From its unique to this area, plants and trees, to the usually easy catfish and rainbow trout fishing in the state park's Dones Pond. To the Caltech Observatory, its world famous telescope resting on the high point of the mountain, 6,100 feet above it all. And whether you're from San Isidro or Oceanside, up here you get the feeling that you're a long way from home.